everyone welcome back to my channel or if this is your first time watching welcome to my channel I am going to be cleaning my house today I want to get started by swapping out my Scentsy wax I have it warming just so I can change it out I use two cotton balls to soak up the wax turn it off throw it in the garbage and put a new scent in I'm using apple a peeling apple I really love this scent. It reminds me a little bit of their pink cotton, but with a little bit of um, like a pear apple scent to it. As always, I'm trying to keep it real with everyone. This is my day off. I am a working mom, so I'm just soaking in all the toddler snuggles that I can get while still trying to maintain um, at least a tidy, a tidy-ish home. Does anybody else throw out their vacuuming dust? outside instead of the garbage. I feel like every time I put it in the garbage, it just goes all over the kitchen. So I just throw it out in the woods. So I was looking in my pantry and I noticed how much of a disaster it is. So today is going to be my pantry disaster makeover. I had already purchased these storage containers in I think it was like May or April and I redid all my baking stuff so I bought another one and I never opened it so we are opening it today cleaning all the containers and seeing what we can fill with them Just had a mini vacation over the weekend for 4th of July and we went to Hershey Park and we saw my in-laws and last night we kind of just fudged out and this is why my house is a mess. It wasn't this messy when I left it, I promise. She is such a little comedian, but it is his nap time, so I'm filling a sippy cup up with milk so he can fall asleep. And while my containers are drying, I'm just going to fold some laundry. All right, check out this terrible pantry disaster. We really need to do something about it, so let's get started. Are you really cleaning your pantry if you're not eating what doesn't fit in the containers? I don't know. So as I was looking through my old pantry, I noticed that it was just as equally of a disaster. So I decided to change up that one too. And my dog's treats, I'm refilling this. I think I got the container at Home Goods a couple years ago, but I love it. It's so cute. As I was going through this, I noticed that there was very old bags of chips and Easter candy. So it looks so much better. I'm so much happier with it. It feels less cluttered and more open space. So when we left for vacation, we took out the trash and uh, put in a garbage bag and I completely forgot that it was my last one. So as I was cleaning out the pantry and throwing old food away, I noticed that I didn't have any more garbage bags and all we had left were these contractor bags. So that's why I have a overflowing garbage bag coming out of my garbage can.
as I turned on my steam mop, I heard my son starting to wake up from his nap. It usually takes him a good like 10 minutes, 15 minutes to fully get up. So I'm just gonna quickly steam mop the floors, get him up from his nap, give him a snack, and then we're gonna go grocery shopping. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope that this brought you some motivation to clean your pantry and get it organized. If anything, I hope it motivated you to clean your kitchen or your living room. I will see you in my next video. Here's a few clips from our vacation. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing.